paint protection film has many benefits. It is able to protect your car from scratches, stone chips, environmental damage, UV ray, and also some other damages as well. It is actually a thin protective layer that is applied onto your car paint to preserve the value and the aesthetics of your car. Hi everyone, my name is Fabian from P10X and today I will be explaining about the process of installing paint protection film. You must be wondering, right, leaving your car here for a couple of days, what are we doing to your car? So let's find out. Firstly, the most important step is to thoroughly clean and wash the car. So basically, you want the car surface to be free of dirt and also debris. So the proper way to wash your car is very important. We can also use a clay bar to ensure that there is no dirt that is etched onto the car surface and to make sure that the car is clean and free of dust. After cleaning the car, you will notice that if there are some stains, some minor scratch marks, sore marks on the car, it is a good idea to do a round of paint correction and polishing to ensure that there are no marks before installing the PPF on the car. Each part of the car requires different measurement and dimensions to work with. So we will measure properly and cut the film to specific size. But we will make sure to leave a little bit extra film around the edges to ensure we have enough to work with. Now, let's move on to the installation of the PPF. So first, we will have to spray on a little bit of soap water onto the areas that you want to cover with PPF. The next step is to remove the backing of the film so that we can install it and properly aligning it onto the car paint. This backing of the film is known as the liner. Now, we will have to cover the entire car that you want to protect with the PPF using this method. Spray on some water on top of the PPF and also within the insides. And we'll remove the water from the inside using a squeegee and to make sure that the film is actually intact to the car paint. This is one of the most important steps of installing the PPF because if there is one piece of dust or a bit of dirt inside the film, we will have to make sure that it's not there. We have to clean it up properly before we install it. The process of installation looks easy but it's actually much more difficult, especially on curvy areas. Some parts of the car requires even more skill where you have to properly manage the curves of the car, especially on the bumper area. And the next step here is to carefully trim the edges of the PPF. As you can see, this is a special blade that is used to actually trim the PPF. This blade is specially used to cut PPF. It will reduce the possibility of damaging the car paint. This process is actually a most important step of installation of the PPF. A good workmanship versus a poor workmanship actually depends a lot on this process. If you do not know how to trim the edges of the PPF properly, you will end up damaging the car paint. And finally, the last process is actually to use a heat gun to actually hit onto the edges, especially the edges on the film, to activate the adhesive and also make sure that it covers the car properly and it bonds well and doesn't lift up.
and that's the entire process to install PPF. Remember, we rinse and repeat for every single part of the car that is supposed to install PPF and that will be the full installation. That's all for the video today. Thank you so much for watching. If you're interested to know more about these kind of contents again, remember to like, share and subscribe to us and follow us to the next video.